Trust, bond, love, cuddle, calm, connected. These are the terms we associate with oxytocin, the hormone produced within our bodies during sex or lactation. We're hearing about oxytocin everywhere. TV, news sources, magazines, Twitter. It's true that oxytocin does some spectacular neuro work on our feelings and emotions, but oxytocin is also a superhero in the way it impacts our bodies. Oxytocin has been linked to more restful sleep, lower blood pressure, reduced stress, less pain, improved healing, weight loss. Here's how our bodies work. We combat stressors every day. Road construction on the way to pick up the kids from school, a report due at tomorrow morning's staff meeting, house training the puppy. When these stressors begin to act upon our body, cortisol is produced. Cortisol causes our bodies to experience nasty stress responses that include rapid heart rate, increased blood pressure, shallow breathing, and hyper-alertness. And the superhero of hormones that can take on big bad cortisol, oxytocin. Oxytocin is released, which counters the production of cortisol, thus slowing down our heart rate, lowering our blood pressure, bringing our breathing back to normal, and promoting nurturing and relaxing sensations. Oxytocin has done its job. The stressor has been defeated, and our bodies are relaxed and at rest. In this state, it's no wonder that we are able to enjoy improved sleep, leaving us refreshed and ready to meet the next day's challenges. When oxytocin is released, pain doesn't hurt as much. Studies have shown that oxytocin decreases the levels of pain reported by subjects receiving electrical shocks, and there is promising results being done on oxytocin's potential use in treating fibromyalgia patients. Additionally, oxytocin has been linked with higher levels of antibody called immunoglobulin, which helps your body combat viruses and infections. Remember cortisol, the hormone produced when we are stressed or anxious? When cortisol stays at high levels, it damages our bodies, resulting in elevated blood fats and sugar, which are linked to obesity. Obesity is related to many disorders, such as diabetes and high blood pressure. A new book, Venus on Fire, Mars on Ice, written by Dr. John Gray, suggests that whatever we can do to increase our levels of oxytocin can make us calmer, reduce cravings, and aid in diet and weight loss efforts. A recent study showed that eating salty snacks increases the oxytocin in our bloodstream. Unfortunately, eating salty snacks is another pathway to high blood pressure and weight gain. There are many natural methods by which to release a constant flow of oxytocin. Many of these require human contact, such as gentle touches and hugging, singing, dancing, exercise, spending time with friends, and social networking have been proven effective as well. There are also oxytocin supplements available which can increase oxytocin levels in our bodies. Oxytocin, the superhero of hormones. It feels good to be happy.